Facial Army, your key to daily success. And it's true. We all have the opportunity to step up at different times in different ways when we know action needs to be taken. And, and in the Marine Corps, you know, one of the things we call that was moral courage. The right thing to do isn't always the easy or most comfortable. Definitely not the most comfortable thing to do, right? I remember uh, I was at headquarters Marine Corps. We were in cubicle land and about six or seven folks were in one little cubicle area. I leaned up against the sidewall of the entryway and they're talking and it was about gays in the military and some derogatory comments were being made. And now this is at the the don't ask, don't tell. When I first enlisted, it was, if you were gay, you couldn't serve. Then don't ask, don't tell came along. They didn't ask, I didn't tell, but you could tell. <laughs> right. <laughs> so, so I'm leaning up against the little thing and I'm going through this dilemma of, okay, what do I do? What do I do? What do I say? How do I, I, I just can't say nothing, right? And just walk away. And in that moment I said, you know, I really don't appreciate the conversation we're having in this moment because honestly, my mom's gay. Yeah, that was so not true. <laughs> but it worked, right? And the point is, it could have been somebody's mom, right? Any one of those people that were, we never know who we're impacting with those kind of comments and conversation. And when we talk about culture at work and what are we creating, Really, what are we creating? And just by standing idly by, and I mean, I'm not saying you're on a, every single thing, you're on the lookout, oh, you know, you gotta step in. No, but when we have that opportunity, when we're in that place, and we can make an impact to where hopefully people can see it or hear it or feel it, are we taking that moment to step up, to stand up, and to use our voice? Because things are only gonna change, folks, if we step into that gap.